boys can take their shoes off and leave them in the kitchen, all right? Yeah, all right, John. Hello, baby. It's all right. You too, Mark. That's right, Barbara. Remember the radiator. Yeah, all right, John. That's it, Polly. What, man? All right, that's a good boy. You can take your coat off now. Can take my coat, John. Hmm. Yeah. Can you manage? Yeah, of course you can. Can I take your coat, Mark? No, I'm wearing it. Fine, right, no problem. As you will. Come on, Mark. Shoes off. Oh, yes, Auntie Barbara. Good boys, aren't we? You all right, Mavis? Don't call me Mavis. Let's state your jeans. It's mud. I can see it's mud. Right, I'll just pop upstairs and put my shoes on, eh? Right, my wife. What you been doing? Nothing. I'm going to state your trousers. It's mud. I can see it's mud. How am I going to get them clean? Wash it. Shoes on outside the front door. I'll do when I've done this. Apart from the house, I'm going to break their neck on that coming up the stairs. Yeah, it's all right, Barbara. Don't worry. Relax. I'm relaxed, thank you. Get down. No. You'll break it. Good. Then you can pay for it. What do you care? There, Mark, please. Yes, Uncle John. Thank you. Can I give you a hand with the tables, Barbara? Yes, please, John. We'll put them all out again. Right. Don't worry, Frank. I'll tee up soon. You see it. Find yourself. There you go, Frank. I'll pass this over to you, John. When you're ready, Barbara. Right. Oh, oh no, no, I'll leave no, that, Mark. It now. Yeah, well, it's pointless without the milk. I'll get it then. It's only in the kitchen. No, you come sit down. I'll get it. But Mavis... Yeah, I'm all right. But you're really starting to get on my nerves a little bit now, Mavis. Come on, give me that. That's it. Pour it out in the jug so we can serve it up nicely. It's all right? This lawn needs a trim. I thought you were going to have one of them canopy things. Patio, yeah. Oh, yeah, patio. What happened to that, then? Well, we thought about it, Frank, you know, with the patio doors, but, uh, I rather fancy a picture window myself. A what? Picture window. Yeah, no wood, straight down to the floor. Very nice effect. Lots of light and space. Just one big pane. That's the end thing now, is it? Well, I don't know about that, Frank, but I like it. Oh, well, it's your money. That's right. Do you get many burglars round here, do you, John? No, we don't. Touch wood. See what's on the TV, eh? It's a doddle, this house. Oh, why? Have you been casing the joint, Mark? It ain't worth it. Listen to him, the master criminal. Goodbye, kiss him, Mark. Yeah, all right then. then. Oh, charming. You'll give you a nice kiss, won't you? Kiss him. Oh, what's in the field? Here you are. It's a little treat for you on the way home, all right? Now what you're giving him? More smellies. I think Mum's feeling a bit better now, isn't she? I don't know. Pop round and see her next week, eh? Well, it's been nice seeing you, Mavis. Tell. See you Christmas then. Yes, I look forward to that, Frank.
I think we should do something a bit more adventurous for the Gillespies this year. They don't like anything adventurous, do they? What happened to her with the fondue? Could do steak again. No, chops. Can't give them chops. Why not? Well, they can have chops any old time. Oh, well, you choose. He's your boss. I don't suppose she can taste it anyway, the rate she shovels it down her throat. Hmm. Are we friends again now? What do you mean? Well, you've been walking around all day with a face as long as a poker. I haven't got much time for Mavis and her family. Well, I haven't got much time for your boss and his fat wife. Well, at least the Gillespies aren't rude when they come here. Who's been rude to you today, apart from Frank? Mark. Mark's not rude. You just don't appreciate his sense of humour. What sense of humour? The boy's immature. And Colin wouldn't say boo to a goose. Well, Colin's just retarded. He's not retarded. He's just never been given a chance. You could be a good influence on those boys if you wanted to be. Who, me? Yeah. They're not my responsibility, Barbara. All right. They've got to learn to stand on their own two feet. Yeah. to redecorate this room. It's depressing. Did you know, before 1980, the last time England won the Grand Slam was in Where do you normally keep it? Pocket. Which pocket? Trousers. What's your name? Colin. Surname. Pollock. Pollock. Initials? What's your middle name? Richard. Address? 111 Bryant Court, Whiston Road, London E2. Write your name on this piece of paper. Yeah, you can do more while you're waiting. No, you wait your turn. I wasn't jumping at you, was I? I didn't say you were. Just thought I'd save you a bit of time, that's all. I'm not in a hurry. Are you? Yes, I am. <laughs> 